uh, Virgin Galactic completing its first space flight in two years on Saturday. This was pretty cool. The spacecraft VSS Unity was carried up to an altitude of about 44,000 feet by a carrier aircraft, and then it was released. And it then fired its rocket engines and accelerated to more than three times the speed of sound. It performed a slow backflip in microgravity at the edge of space and returned to Earth, landing at the runway of Spaceport America in New Mexico. Now, the company has to meet two more FAA milestones to receive a key license for conducting regular space flights. Uh, but if it all happens, we could all be uh, on, our, on a trip to view space. Shares surging over the past few days after the company announced plans for that flight, avoiding a possible maintenance issue that threatened to delay the test. And you're looking at that stock up about 25, 26 percent. Uh, and after its average trading, we'll see where things uh, begin the day this morning. Mm -hmm. Joe? It really is like Buck Rogers or something. You know, still going uh, to pass for a little while, I think. Um, you know, no, uh, no, no bungee jumping, no roller coasters, no, uh, definitely not uh, backflips in micro space or whatever you just said. Shepard Smith here. Thanks for watching CNBC on YouTube.